Anything in here. There's gotta be something in here. Oh, that is so scary. That is... Oh my god! Oh shit! Help! Oh my gosh! Yo, scan the fuck out- No! Move, bitch! Look how amazing that looks. That is so cool. Oh man. I love it. Anyway. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Jay, and today we're gonna play another episode of Subnautica. Um... So let's see, I have two plans for this video. Uh, the first is, I actually built a, uh, hey, check me out, look. I actually built a radiation suit off camera, so I'm like super excited about that. Uh, now that I have the radiation suit, I am so, I'm going to make a beeline for the Aurora. I'm going to go to the Aurora. Uh, people have been telling me not to do that, but I'm way too curious. Like the more you tell me not to do something, the more I'm going to want to do it. And I'm going to go check that out, see if I can get close to it. The last time I tried getting close to it, you know, there was a lot of, like, radiation going on, and I couldn't get very close at all. But now that I have the radiation suit, that should be hopefully no problem. I want, definitely want to go check it out. Uh, the other thing I want to do, I want to go over there, back to the cave system, where those, um, those giant snakes were. I want to go check that out as well, now that I can, uh, now that I have a rebreather, I should have no problem going down there and exploring, hopefully. Um, so that's the goal. I wish I could do this at in like daylight. It's like nighttime right now, but maybe I'm thinking I should actually top off on some food and water before I go. So I'm going to go ahead and grab some fish real quick if I can. As a matter of fact, I think I actually have something in my inventory. Um, I've got some cured peeper and some water bottles, but I'm not going to use those. I'm going to save those. Let me go ahead and top off real quick. Grab that guy right there. Maybe a couple of the uh, the bladder fish and some regular guy, like this guy right here. This is the boomerang. Come here. Oh my god, they're so hard to grab. Okay, got him. Maybe a couple more and I'll be good. Here's another one right here. That's two. One more. And we got that guy. Maybe one more bladder fish. Here we go. Coming from above. Got him. Okay. Let's go top off our health real quick. A little tasty snack for the road. Got one more. All right. Now we have everything we need. Let's see. Go in here. And we're going to pop those real quick. A couple water bottles. Do one more. I'm going to leave those three right there. Just in case I need it. When I'm out in the cave. All right. So, okay. Now I can see. This is much better. So let's go ahead and make our way over here. I think I need to, um, I might need to craft another battery. I only have like 41% power left in my sea glide. Actually, I think I have a uh, battery on me, don't I? I don't. Maybe I should grab one before I go over to the cave because I'm definitely going to need it. That 41% is going to burn out quick. But I'm going to go down. I think I stored some in my... I had like a little locker storage thing around here somewhere. Where's my pod? It was like directly below the pod right here. Let's see if I have any in here. Um, no, but I do have some materials. No, that's not what I need. What about this one right here? No batteries. Okay, maybe... I'm going to double check the pod real quick. Maybe I stored it in the... And the storage right here. I got a power cell. I don't want to use that, do I? I don't want to use a power cell. I want to use a battery. I might have to craft one. I definitely should do that before I go anywhere. So I need, uh, looks like I need copper and two acid mushrooms. Do I have any copper in there? No, I don't. I do think, I think I saw some copper in the, uh, one of the lockers here. If not, I know where to find some. I'll just pick some up on the way. That's gold. There we go. We got copper. And a couple of these. Mushrooms. And we're good. Nice. Okay, now we're going to go over to the cave. Let's go this way. This should be fun. I mean, I really hope I can actually like explore the cave. I couldn't last time because um, I just don't have... Well, I didn't have a rebreather, so I, like I ran out of oxygen really quickly. But now I think it should be no problemo. 
So that's definitely what we're going to do. We're going to go explore. Maybe I should also grab a couple more bladder fish on the way. That way I can, if I absolutely need to, I know if I eat those, I can actually restore a bit of my oxygen. So let me, before I go any further, let me see if I can grab a couple. There's one right there. Got him. That might be smart, right? Here's another one. Grab this guy. Okay, now we should be good. I'm looking for the cave. It's down there, right there. Maybe, uh... I hope I didn't waste too much oxygen right there. Let's go down. As a matter of fact, let's go ahead and, uh, let's see if I pop one of these bladder fish, what happens. There we go. I think we're good now. Now we're good. Okay, we got 27% left in our, uh... Guys, I'm doing it! We're exploring the cave! Oh my gosh! We're in here. Oh, that is so creepy. What is that? It's like a giant snake looking thing. Alright, let's start scanning stuff. Can I scan that? Open crate? What's in here? A med kit? Oh, that's a sign. <laughs> I guess I need the med kit, huh? Anything in here? There's gotta be something in here. Oh, that is so scary. That is... Oh my god! Oh shit! Help! Oh my gosh! Yo, scan the fuck out- No! Move, bitch! Yo, get the fuck away from me! Yo, we're getting out of here, bro. No, this was a setup. This was a setup. Yo, I'm about to die. This was a fucking setup. That came out of nowhere! <laughs> oh shit, I can't breathe! Oh my gosh. I don't want to leave at the same time. Oh, I don't want to leave. It like went into that giant mushroom. I think I need to leave because uh, I'm running low on uh, oxygen. And yeah, I need to fucking get out of here. And I don't even know where to go to get out of here. Bro, where's it? Oh my gosh. Do I have anything to help me? Water's not going to help me. Dude, I think I'm about to die. No shot. There's no way. This was a setup. I got fucking set up down here. This is a no shot. Bro, I am so pissed right now. I am so pissed right now. <laughs> what the fuck happened? <laughs> no. That I am so mad. That was a setup. Fuck it. I'm going back. I ain't no bitch. Where is it? Where do I go? I just I feel like that was why did no one tell me all right so let's see I got to find I got to use a beacon oh it's already marked where is it let me uh let me do that there it is okay so maybe I need like a what's that thing called I need to craft a um uh, look at blueprints Fuck, man, I can't get over that. Like, my heart is beating so hard right now. This just turned into a horror game in the blink of an eye. Okay, so I've got these blueprints here, but what I'm looking for, the sea moth. I don't know what I need to do. I can get these materials, but I can't craft it. I'm missing something. I don't. I can't. obviously can't craft it at the uh, fabricator, but I feel like this might be what I need to uh, to explore that cave. So I need to, I'm going to go ahead and pin this for now. Um, but I'm going to try, I'm going to try again. I'm going to try again. I just have to be, I'm going to grab a whole bunch of these guys. Where'd you go? I'm going to grab a whole bunch of these guys. That way, uh, fuck, where did he, where did he go? They're so, they're so hard to catch all of a sudden. <laughs> okay. That was so, that was crazy. I should maybe um, eat some food, but I do have some, uh, I mean, I do have something here my inventory I'll go ahead and eat it now there we go now we're good a couple more bladder fish would be great I'm thinking I need like five of these now it's like when I, when I run past them they like fucking disappear there we go maybe a couple more there is one these guys are everywhere which is really really helpful you and get you as well okay now i think i have like i've got four of them one more can i get this guy nice okay now i have five of these guys 
So now I feel a little bit more comfortable going back. Oh, I am terrified. Now I don't want to go anywhere near those, uh, those things. They're just so creepy. Okay. What do we have here? Oh, we got a PDA? Nice. Alright, I've got like... 70 oxygen right now. Is there anything for me to scan here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, it gets deeper. I don't know about that. Alright, I'm running I'm running low and I don't know where the... Uh, the exit is. It's like so dark down here. I can't see anything very well. Yeah, see? Like, now I'm freaking... I'm lost already. Oh, here we go. There we go. Okay, let's get up there real quick. So we got something there. Let me go ahead and take a look at it right now. Um, we have the data bank. Downloads. The Gassy Survivors. What is this? Uh, let's see. User Paul Torgel requested cross-referencing of local environment scans with ideal habitat construction conditions displaying results. Large subterranean cavern with multiple entrances. Conditions support a unique microcosm of predatory life forms, minor structural instability in cave walls, extensive resource deposits. Uh, average environment safety rating C, optimal habitat site ra uh, safety rating B. Site 7 has been selected as the optimal habitat construction site for the following reasons. Close proximity to one of the cave entrances in case of emergency, medium distance from predatory organism, organisms, stable foundations on which to build ready access to materials, a signal tracking the site has been created. So this is a good place to build a little habitat is what I'm gathering. Um, like inside the cavern or like next to it, like right outside. Hard to say, but uh, I can't imagine building a habitat in that thing. I mean, that was scary, but I'm going to go back in. I'm going to see if there's anything else I can find. Let me see. I don't think I read everything I could have, actually. Maybe there was something more? No, these are... No. I think we're good. I think that was everything. I kind of want to, like, scan these things. I don't want to get too close. Fuck! Yep! Yeah. Nope! 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 Oh, no. No, 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 no. It's okay. It's okay, sir. Help! Oh, he's coming for me! Help! Now I'm lost? Oh my god. Bro, stay away from me. Holy shit, he's coming for me. Leave me alone. Oh my gosh. Help! Is he coming? Oh my gosh, that is so fucking scary. Let me, uh... Let me pop one of these. I'm not ready to go back up. I'm not ready to go back up. As a matter of fact, let me go ahead and, uh... Yeah. I'm not ready. I am not ready. I came down here on a mission, and I'm going to see it done. Looks like there's something over here for me to scan. Potentially. And, god damn it, I'm going to scan it. Okay, no, this is where I was. Oh, god. Oh, my gosh. I don't know what to do anymore. I don't, I don't know where to go. Fuck. Maybe I should get out of here. I'm running low on oxygen right now. I think I'm too... Holy crap. Yeah, we need to fucking... We need to go. <laughs> we need to go. Did I eat all my... Oh, no. I got one more. I got one more. Uh, they're screaming behind me. I can hear them. I can hear them. Is there anything around here for me to explore? Oh. oh, I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. Leave me alone. Grab you. This place is so scary. Okay, I think... Um... Oh, he's coming after me. Help! All right, here we go. Okay, those mushrooms right there. That's kind of how I figured out where to go. Those are helpful. I don't think he's following me anymore. All right, let's get back up. We're running super low on oxygen right now. Wait a minute, did I not go over there? Oh, wait a minute. I didn't explore the uh, Degassi habitat. I didn't check that out. Let's check that out. I can't believe I forgot about that. And that's... Okay, that's on the way. It's a little bit past the uh, the pod. So let's go back to the pod first. And then we're going to go check that out. That should be fun. I thought it was referring to um, the cave that we were just at. Apparently not. 
So that's good. Wherever this uh, this habitat is, maybe that's where I can build my first habitat. And hopefully it's safe. According to uh, the data thing, it was safe. Can I go through here? Oh, shit. Oh, yeah, this is where this is when the first video this is where I put my flares. Definitely copper in here, right? Yep, got some copper, got some copper, got some copper. Yep, 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 yep. I hear you. Got the copper. I hear you. Uh-huh, I know you're complaining. I don't... You don't like me here. I know you don't like me here. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. You'll be okay, you'll be okay. Good boy, good boy, you'll be okay. Damn, I just like zoomed right through there. Okay, let's go back. Flashlight, I need that. I need that. Let's do it. But how do I use a flashlight? Okay, cool. I just equip it. Nice. We got some goodies over here. If this guy would just leave us alone. Leave us alone. Stay away from that guy. Alright, we got some goodies over here that we can scan. Like this right here. Grav trap. Com uh, gra grav? That's a tongue twister. Grav trap. What is this? Fragment. Okay. We got a counter. I don't know what that is. Let's get this bad boy right here, too. Okay, let's get out of here, because these guys are trying to, like, bite my ankles, and I do not have a lot of health. Okay, let's go back down. Let's, uh... Let's do this empty-handed. Alright, so, anything else, anything else, anything else. Here's another fragment right here. Oh, I can hear that guy behind me. Calm down, man. Calm down. No one is trying to hurt you. Calm down. <gasps> sea glide fragment. Okay. Is there anything else here? Doesn't look like it. There's got to be something more. I think we're good. I think I got everything for now. Let's get some. Uh, let's get some oxygen real quick. Bro, what are you doing, man? Calm down. All right, let's try to figure out how to uh, get inside this cave. Is this it? No, it doesn't look like it. I need to figure out how to get in there. It's like right below me. I don't think this is the way at all. Oh my gosh. Oh shit. What the fuck? Did that thing just explode? That thing exploded. Let me grab that. Oh yeah, someone mentioned that. Uh, that's where they come out of the um, the sulfur plants thing and explode on you. Excuse me, pardon me, excuse me. Let's get up here. Nope, that's not the way in, is it? Nope. Neither is right there. Okay, I feel like I can grab you. Eat you real quick, get some oxygen. Got some quartz on the walls. Oh, there's a... Oh my gosh, I might just hang out here for a second. Collect all this stuff. Oh, nope, that's not... That's not a... Oh my gosh, you just exploded on me. Pause. Grab that. I think there's another one up here. Thank you. Oh yeah, this is like a dopamine hit every time I break one. Oh my, that's a big boy. Give me that. Can I get some oxygen, please? Somewhere, anyone, anyone, anyone. Do I have a bladder fish? I do not. I do not have a bladder fish to give me oxygen. I think I gotta go up. Oh, here's one right here. I think I have to go up anyway. You have to go up. It's right there. It's close by. What is that right there? What is that? Oh, it's a uh, little coral thing. How do I get down there? I gotta figure this out, man. I gotta figure this out, man. Maybe, okay, maybe over this side. If I go down here. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, we're getting closer. We're getting closer, man. We're getting closer. In it. In it, bruv. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. Yo, my sea glide is on 10% right now. Which is not good at all. Okay, where is it? 
There's got to be like an entrance around here somewhere. And I feel like I am not getting any closer to it. So uh, let's take this a uh, little bit. Let's take this a little slow. Oh, did we find it? Doesn't feel like it. Feels like what I found was death. Oh my gosh. Oh, he's he's really they're really they're really trying to kill me. This game is so hostile, man. There's nothing friendly about this game. It looks cute on the surface, but it is dangerous. Okay, let's go. Let's get one more of these guys. And I do have a battery check, right? Yeah, I do have battery. So I can waste my last 10%. I think that'll be fine. Got radiation. Okay, I'm back. Oh, look. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, I found it. But there's radiation here. Which is not good. And uh, I'm low on health. Oh my, we are so close. Is that really where we are? I didn't realize it was so close to the uh, Aurora. Oh, I'm dying. Oh, this is so... Oh my gosh. This is not good. Not good at all. I don't think I'm going to make it. I don't think I'm... I'm losing health so fast. Oh, we could do it. Come on, buddy. We could do it. We could do it. No make it's right? No make it's. If I get out the water? No? Fuck, dude. I don't understand. Oh my gosh. That's the second time I died in this video. Ugh, I'm so mad. That, I am so mad right now. Okay, let's check out this message. We got a message. We're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. What? It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. We should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Hold up, what? The sunbeam is coming to get me in 40 minutes? <gasps> oh, it's right there. No, that's got, that can't be right. That can't be right. There's no way. Where is it? Where, where am I looking? Over there? Oh, I feel like I got plenty of time. Do I have time to... Uh, I think I have time. Wh okay, so real quick. What am I not understanding? I got the radiation suit. Gloves. Am I missing anything? Okay, I got the helmet right here. But don't I need the uh, the rebreather? Let me switch to the uh, let me switch those out real quick. Let's see if that makes a difference. I don't know if it will. I mean, if it does make a difference, that would actually make sense. So let's give it a try. Okay, it looks like I have plenty of time before. I mean, that's only a thousand meters. It's not bad, right? I can get that. I can get there quickly. I think. I hope. I hope. Okay. Let's see now. Um, I think it's actually working because. Right about now, there was definitely radiation here before. Okay, now we can't see anything. Okay, this isn't what this is not the right place. Passing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. Okay, so that's where that comes in handy, right? But there's radiation. Okay, there's not radiation. I was here. I was already here. Oh hell no. Yo, it really brought me back here. Oh my gosh. It really brought me back here. Is it gonna come get me? Fuck. Okay, hold up. I need air. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die again. This is gonna be the third time I die in the video. Yeah, look. Look at it. Just chilling inside. Oh, no way. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Please don't see me. Leave me alone. Do I... Oh, I can scan that whole thing. Please nobody hurt me. Just minding my own business. 
<laughs> leave me alone, leave me alone. Okay. Scan that. Um, I can't go in here, can I? I just feel like there's so much more in here. I might need to go get oxygen soon. When I get down to like 40, I think. I guess I just gotta scan all the parts here. Modification station, what is that? Alright, I got a little bit more oxygen left. Oh, I can go inside. Damn, I need to- okay, I need to go get oxygen real quick. Let's see if we can be a little efficient here. We have a little time. Oh no, okay. Maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Anything in here? Oh, we got that. That's good. Oh my gosh. Bro, get in there. I'm stuck. Get in there. We're running out of time. Chair. Oh, come on. Please work faster. These things kill, okay? I've died to them already. Grab that. We got another PDA. Okay, we got like 20 seconds. I don't think there's anything else in here. I'm looking. I'm really looking. I'm looking. I'm looking. There's nothing else in here. But what about, like, around? I don't think there's anything else I can scan. Right? There was something here. Fuck. I'm out of, uh... I might need to do this again. One more trip. One more trip to do it. Oh my gosh. Yo, there's something in there. Bruh. Wall... Planter? I am like way too close to this uh, mushroom right now. How do I get inside? Oh, spotlight? Bro, if I get like, if I get jump scared right now, I can't get in there, can I? Oh no! Holy shit! Help! Help! <laughs> get me out of here, coach! <sighs> it was a scam! Fuck. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna cry. Let's switch these out real quick. <laughs> There's so much more down there. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. This is so difficult. I need that guy to go back into the mushroom, please. Thank you. Go back in. Go back in. We got business to attend to. Stop making all that noise. Leave me alone. And let me, let me go back in here real quick and go to this side. Oh, there we go. We fucking died. We, we fucking died. Just got to go through here. Just got to be careful. So that guy right there. Oh my God. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> ah! Help. Okay. Do I go this way? Nope. Don't go that way. No, 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 no. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're good. We just gotta be careful. I didn't realize my health actually re... regened. Got you, sir. Scan the bed. Got a queen-size bed here. For me and the mistress. It looks like there's something else over here. Got you. Yeah, we're, we're goaded right now. We're goaded right now. We just gotta stay alive. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't give a shit. Let's get out of here. Yo, we did it. We got it. So let's go back to the uh, let's go back to the pod and check out those uh and check that out. I cannot believe we pulled that off. That was terrifying, but we did it. All right, I need to switch over to my radiation mask helmet. And where am I going? How do I get out of here? First, I need some air. That's for sure. Watch me do all that and die <laughs> from uh, oxygen. Yeah, I'm coming for that. Uh, hopefully, I don't know when. Soon. I'm, go I'm going for it. We just get, we just keep getting closer and closer. Uh, I forgot what my... Ooh, what is this? Oh, that's a creep vine sample that I dropped earlier. Turn that off. I didn't realize I had my... Uh, my, my headlights on okay let's can we play it i thought we had a message no we didn't have a message but we did have well we did have a message and we checked it 
Look at all that titanium. I'm loving it. But we have a voice lock? Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Okay, that's... All right, we already listened to that. Data bank, blueprints. So we got some habitat installation recipes. Okay, these should be fun. I'm going to have to look through those. Was there anything else? Right? Yeah, here we go. I thought it might get claustrophobic living underwater. Father feels it is. He'd tell me it was childish, but I stare out the window and sometimes I think how lucky I am to see this world up close. Back on the island, I wouldn't have believed the creatures that live down here. The fish, they glow. There's one that's 90% eyeball. Snakes twice the length of a habitat compartment. <sighs> yeah, so yeah. me, it's not all friendly. Most of the plant life is toxic. I learned that the hard way. But I've managed to coax some marble melons into growing indoors. And when they don't cover our dietary needs, well, we eat the fish themselves. It's a bit gross, but there's nothing they wouldn't do. I've been attempting to document my findings. Father approves. He says understanding is power. That the more we know about this planet, the more we can use it to our advantage. I'm just doing it because it's fun. It's not easy without proper equipment and network access, but the old-fashioned way, observing, taking notes, testing theories, shows me the world in a way a spectroscopic analysis never could. Lately, I've been watching the crab snakes. They ambush their prey as it tries to feed on the mushrooms they hide in. What they don't eat settles on the seabed, which fertilizes the mushrooms, which feeds the herbivores, and so the chain continues. Co-evolution gives me the fuzzies. Okay, that was really interesting. So it seems when I was in that cave, the giant mushrooms, the snakes, those were, uh, what did he call it? Those were, he just said it. Uh, those were crab something. Crab snakes. <laughs> That's what those are. Those are terrifying. Um, what about this one here? So it goes from, okay, this is a different person. This is Bart. This is Degassi. Let's check this out. Son, there is always a pecking order. And in our world, money makes a hierarchy. I pay Maida a fraction of what I pay you, and you a fraction of what I pay me. If money makes the hierarchy, why is Marguerite making the decisions? We need her. We let her think what she likes, so long as she does what she's told. What if she doesn't? <laughs> For enough money, she will. People always do. What is that about? That is so sketch. We're already 200 meters below sea level. You want to go deeper? Hell yeah. Look around us, chief. Water leaking through the hull, water outside the hatch. We're drowning real slow. If rescue arrives, whatever shot us down, it's going to do it again and again until it's shut off. You see an off switch around here, chief? Why would it any more likely be half a kilometer down? Your kid found something on the scanner. There's something down there. Something that shouldn't be. <laughs> You're mad! I'm going all the same. And I have an idea you two are going to follow. But if you do, be mindful. Your authority stopped at sea level. Okay, first of all, uh, Marguerite, if that was an attempt at a southern accent, that was horrible. <laughs> first of all. But this is really interesting. So it seems like something shot us out of the sky. So it's not like there was some kind of malfunction or accident or anything like that. Something shot us out of the sky, and it's obviously, according to Marguerite here and Bart, it's actually further, it's actually, like, deep, what, let's see, we're already 200 meters below sea level, you want to go deeper, and then she said that there's something down there, half a kilometer down, okay, whatever, but apparently whatever shot us down, there's something big, I guess is what I'm saying, there's something big. Um, far below sea level, and I guess we're probably going to discover what that is at some point. But whatever it is, it shot them out of the sky from below water. I don't know if I'm getting that right, but that's what it sounds like. Real sketchy. Real sketchy. I mean, as far as we can tell, there's only like fucking fish and like, I guess, leviathans here, but like, no really intelligent life forms. You know what I mean? Nothing like a human or anything like that. No technology or anything like that. So I'm kind of curious what can actually shoot that out of the sky. That would be ridiculous. But you know what? The sunbeam is coming to get us. And I have a feeling we're going to find it. We're going to see it get shot out of the sky. That's my best. I That's my best guess. We're going to see it get shot out of the sky. We might even get a glimpse of what it is. 
that shoots it down. But that might be, it looks like it's going to be in the next video. Anyways, um, that's it for today. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all the tips. Thank you for engaging with the videos. I really appreciate it. Uh, enjoy the rest of your day. Stay blessed, and I'll see you next time. Peace.